with the push beam on the side of the ship, I can try again from a different angle. Incorrect. Shh. That is incorrect. The part must be placed on top of the ship to solve this problem. Darren. Yes? Well, it takes the fun out of it when you keep butting in like that. Apologies. Noblet. When it comes to puzzle games, there's nothing I like more than whiling away an afternoon, racking my brains for the answer to that one problem that'll just get me through to the next level. The problem is, it's hard to stop there. Bob Came in Pieces is a puzzle game you can download for the PC that'll get your brain ticking as you try to help Bob, an alien from out of space, recover the pieces of his ship so he can fly home. This is reminiscent of the plot for the classic game Pikmin on GameCube and Wii, which was designed by Shigeru Miyamoto, the creator of Mario, Wii Fit and Zelda. Awesome. As you go collecting parts for Bob's ship, you'll be presented with a puzzle, often in the form of an obstruction, that you'll need to solve to continue on. There are repair stations all over the levels so that you can add and remove parts to your ship to help you. Darren, it kind of reminded me a bit of Spore, how you can change your ship to help you do different things, or World of Goo with those physics-based puzzles that can get quite hard towards the end. Is Bob the ship or the alien? Darren, Bob's the alien inside the ship. Didn't you watch the opening movie? Oh, how dull. I like the way that you can access the ship builder just by pressing enter at any time. It saves any unnecessary flying around. <laughs> And you can save different ship configurations to help you with puzzles later on. Bob Came in Pieces has that magic formula. It's easy to play but tricky to master, and it'll definitely get a few brain cells ticking. We had a good time, didn't we, Darren, working together through those puzzles to help get Bob home? Affirmative. If you like puzzle games, this one's definitely worth a download. I'm just not sure I'd play it again, though. <laughs> I mean, I definitely lost a few afternoons to puzzle-filled bliss, so, you know, I'm giving it seven and a half out of ten rubber chickens. Let's see. May I suggest something? All right, go on, then. 